My recent body of work deals with human figures and their relationship with the landscape. And in my pieces, I have figures coming out of landscapes such as rock-like structures and such like that. And I like to try to create this energy between the two as that unique connectivity that we have with our surroundings. When I begin with the sculptures, they start, I start with a mound of clay and I look for the figure within the clay and let that come out as opposed to having a predetermined sculpture in mind when I start. I like to keep it as intuitive and expressive as possible. And that being mentioned, I prefer to use minimal tool and prefer to let my finger mark making show through. There are several stages of the clay that we work with and it starts with green wear when it's a wet clay to leather hard clay. The first firing is a bisque firing and then there are various other multiple firings that you could do to achieve a specific aesthetic that you're looking for. And today I'm going to be doing raku firing. There are many different results that you can get with raku firing and today I will be working with wet and dry sawdust as well as a mixture of motor oil with sawdust. 